All right, so today we're going to see how you can install a virtual router on your Windows PC so that you can share your VPN connection with any device. And so this is useful if you have devices that don't support a VPN, such as smart TVs or consoles. And it can also be used to bypass device limits uh, set by your VPN company because you only use one connection from your PC and you're just sharing it uh, virtually uh, to all the devices, all the other devices. All right, so first we have to download the software to create this virtual. Uh... All right, so first we have to download this virtual router software. To do so, go to this link, wannaflakes.com slash virtual dash router. And I'll put the link in the description as well. So once you get here, you can uh, scroll down to where it says click here to download it under the step one download and install. So this will uh, download the software. Once it's downloaded, you want to show in folder and then you want to right click and extract all. Click extract to unzip the, the file and to get the executable, the application. Double click to execute to start the installation process. Then as usual, you know, click next. I accept the terms, next. Click install to start. And if you have a pop-up, just click yes. Once you're done, make sure that launch the program is ticked, click finish. And if there's another pop-up, click yes. All right. So as you can, so as you can see here, we have the app running now. Now, before we do anything, you want to connect to your VPN. So for this uh, tutorial, I'm going to use a Wannaflex VPN as an example. I personally use one of Flix VPN because uh, they're fast and also they not only unblock US Netflix, but also unblock UK Netflix, Japan Netflix, and Canadian Netflix. But you can use any uh, VPN uh, app for this. So just connect your VPN. We want to give a name to your virtual uh, Wi Fi network. So I'm just going to put Wi-Fi test, but you can put anything here. Same for the password. You can put anything. Uh, I put password, but feel free to put something more complicated. And then here you want to uh, refresh. And then drop down menu, you want to find your uh, VPN connection. So not the Wi-Fi or the Ethernet one, but your VPN. So for me, it's SSTAP, but for you, it might be another name such as ExpressVPN or uh, NordVPN. Now, once this is all set up, click on Start Virtual Router Plus. And there you go. Your virtual router is started, and you're now broadcasting, your computer is now broadcasting a signal, a Wi Fi signal that you can connect to from any other device, and those devices will be uh, connected through your VPN. All right, so now we're going to use my iPad to test the connection. Um, I don't have a smart TV, so we're using the iPad, but it will also work on your smart TVs. So as you can see here in the network list, we have Wi-Fi test, the network that we just uh, created. And so here I'll just enter my password that we created before, join. <clears throat> So as you can see now, we're, we are connected uh, through our uh, computer VPN connection. So to test that, we can go to Safari and go to whatsmyipaddress.com. And as you can see now, we're in Japan, in uh, Tokyo.